Yo, what's good you guys? I'm back again and this video is about the second objective of the Winter of Woe, which is Gamma. And I just made this video separate from the last objective because this video took a while and there's a lot to go over. So I start off with She-Hulk, which is she supposed to be the best counter? To absorbing man supposedly karate mike says let's hulk but um this is just a montage of how many damn times i died using her so there's so many tips i want to go over and i s used a, like probably three four revives with she hulk and like five potions on her because i thought i was gonna get it but yeah, i feel like the damage mattered more than the utility in this fight with this objective um yeah just you know but that was just for my skill level because if i were to do this again i think i would have a better understanding of what to do but i don't know it's still i took my she hulk to rank three and this is with 30 percent boost and just a bunch of boosts i put on her because I thought that would do the trick. But it didn't, unfortunately. Because all that regen you see, I'm like, alright, petrify, that should be fine. But no, dude, he just might petrify, runs out, my slow runs out. I gotta keep managing it. And also, I have to manage my furies because I need the damage badly. Because once he starts regening when I don't have my petrify, he regens like for the past one minute of damage that i've been doing or past 30 seconds so it's like a, n a non-stop just you know non-stop and i tried to use a heavy attack to get rid of the regen because sometimes it works after he throws a special but it doesn't work as well so yeah as you can see it doesn't work he's just getting health health and it sucks because Maybe if I, 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 you know, she's supposed to be a great counter, but I just couldn't manage to do it. I did this fight with her, like, I thought I did it, like, 20 times, or, fifth, like, 15 times. And, man, this is just, like, like, I, this, I used to revive here, because I, he's at 50%, but the regen keeps getting crazier and crazier, so it just was impossible, and I, I kept getting mad. Because I'm losing my furies, so it's gonna be taking longer, and it's just I'm gonna eventually slip up like right there. And so I decided to restart the game so that that didn't kill me. And I did this a lot because I really needed to get this objective. And I thought, man, if this isn't gonna be impossible, if this is this hard, then the robot or the robot one is gonna be even more impossible. So. I don't want to worry about that yet, but I went back in. Sometimes it, this doesn't work, but it could just pop up and show that you were in a fight and you keep all your health. But sometimes it won't do that and you'll just, it'll exit you out the fight and you'll lose half your health, but you still didn't lose your attempt. So back to square one kind of. And yeah, this fight, this takes longer with she hulk compared to who I actually used, which I'm going to spoil. Um, you can probably already know who it is. It is OG Hulk. Um, and he is a 7 star. Which is even better. And he does better damage. But no utility really for this fight. But still, he is quicker. So his damage is great. And it's quick. So it's enough so to the point where he doesn't regen a whole lot. And I can manage that. But I thought I could do it with G Hulk. So I... Yeah, I was still trying and also while managing the petrify, the slow, his power, and my furies, I had to, um, I wanted to keep track of my damage type because if I was on physical while he was in his Uru form, I would be doing like 80% less damage. And so I try, I kept trying to mitigate it, you know, manage it, get, um, deactivate his form or just switch my damage type. And so... There's just too much going on to the point where, yeah, he, he just, you know, start regening. There's just so much. It's like, I'm countering him, but then he's countering me. So, I don't know. I just couldn't get it clean. 
but you know she's still a great rank up um i'm probably gonna use her in the future she's she has great utility just for this fight it's a bit too much for her to handle uh, at least for my skill level because this is some msd type skill level you need to get him down with she hulk unless you get really lucky because the one thing that could have saved me is just if i had kept my furies up if he and he that requires him to throw special attacks and that requires me to push him to special attacks but not the wrong one because if he refines his special two his magma form i'm done unless i deactivate it because you know how that goes so i start stacking on my furies here it starts to work but the solos i've seen with her people have had like 50 furies so i was trying to get there but you know it's not that easy this late in the fight um and i if i use a revive i feel like that's almost kind of an obligation to keep going until you win because if you use a revive then back out and use another champion it's like really like you know you wasted a revive and right right there his regen was massive and he got back like the past I don't know two minutes it was just crazy and I was getting really mad you know I wasn't calm and so I actually restarted the fight to try to get a solo didn't work and that probably was another clip from me reviving again this is probably clips from me just reviving again and backing out but yeah so I was just dying so much basically it was pretty bad but you know I went in with OG Hulk I'm like finally this might i don't know i thought i'd say finally but i'm like this might work because karate mike got a solo with him just blazing through with some special three damage he gets like an insane physical vulnerability um pretty wild and so i tried going through this with him i'm gonna warn you it took me a revive so this fight is not easy easily solo soloable because it's 1 million health and the solo 1 million health with all these nodes and stuff it's a whole lot but right here the special three i'm in the right form of damage and i do like 10 percent of his health right there around 10 percent because it the physical vulnerability like i think it activates off the bat i don't know but i'm also doing crazy damage here and i decide you know what i'm probably gonna have to use revive but i just go for it I know I might not win, but I'm just doing a crazy, like, a pretty good amount of damage. And I'm like, you know what? I have stuns, I have a striker. If he's at least going to get to, like, half his health. And that's good enough for me. But, um, he gets close to half. And I'll say one attempt. I'm like, you know what? Do I push my luck? And I decide, you know what? I might. I might as well try. Um, probably not the best idea, guys. But, you know, I had some revives, and I bought, I've bought i bought some from, like, the store and stuff. But, you know, I thought if he could do that amount of damage, all I need to do is mitigate, of course, and control his regen, and do that again. And just, you know, just kind of, I, I wasn't overthinking it, because I just had to go for it. And I was done with this objective, and I thought, I didn't think he was going to punish me there. But, you know, like, you know what? I'm going to do the little trick, restart the game to get back in my flow because that's not great. And unfortunately, I lose half my health here because of, you know, I just didn't pause it correctly or whatever. So it's still fine. I still saved my attempt. Um, not wasting a revive like that. I'm definitely not going to just let him hit me like that. And so my boost run out. I have a good amount of 30% boosts and I've been using them for this fight because it is definitely needed unless you you are like the richest player in the game and have seven star rank threes max save or something I don't know you don't need boost then uh, it has to be the right champion so here I'm just doing what I said I was gonna do <clears throat> however I have less health and so guys it really depends who you have. I would say out of the two champions that I use in this video for the Gamma Objective, whoever you're able to rank up easier 
or whoever's like a set uh, I mean she hulks not a seven star but if you have Hulk as a seven star I would use him um and if you don't and they're both six stars whoever is easier to rank up if whoever's like a rank higher or whatever just use them but you know it also depends on how you want to play it because do you want to play it more slow and controlled with She-Hulk and kind of have to manage a whole lot of stuff but just more controlled or do you want to try this OG Hulk uh, style method and just go for it go for the damage and as you can see you probably be doing a whole lot of this stuff um I did die I didn't die here but it was good cuz I got some damage off and damn like that was some pretty nice damage he got refined and luckily I deactivated it so that was pretty lucky right there but he's now down to 34% health and I'm actually chilling I'm thinking like this is it this is the run and so here I mean he has to throw a special you know I'm not overthinking it I'm almost dying though but I'm just trying to, you know, I'm trying to bait it out. He's not throwing it. And then, unfortunately, I just pushed him to the special three. I don't know why I did this, actually. But if I could have gotten to my rage form and got a long stun, that could have been it. And so, there goes another revive, but probably the last one I have to use. So... Yeah, it is, I'm pretty sure it's the last one I have to use. Um, I don't know how worth it this fight was. It depends on the next few Winter of Woe fights. But, you know, I had fun. Overall, I had fun. Like, it was, you know, it, I'm glad it didn't, like, drain units or the life out of me. Because, um, I, I it, it's a pretty damn hard fight, but I had fun at some points of the fight. I just, if they were to remove any one of the nodes, make it so I can have dot damage, or make it so I can, you know, not have to deal with the regen, which is just part of this kit. Actually, you can't do that, which, you know, whatever. It kind of sucks, but, um, as you can see, I got him 150 thousand special three insane and i'm like yeah he is just dead that was crazy and that's what you're going to be seeing if you use hulk so you gotta play him right though make sure you know what you're doing in this fight this is a very high skill level fight um but there we go and the fight is done for the gamma objective very nice i don't know how about how clean that was but it was clean enough. I had two revives. Um, not not three, right? Yeah, it's like two revives. Not bad. Another one done. And I'm also... This is also... This is a uh, Deathless King group piece in the Winter of Woe objective. So, this is going to get me closer to there. And I want all the Deathless champions, man. I want, I want Thanos. I just want all of them. I feel like it's going to be a real big payoff in the end. Or it's just really cool to have them. I don't know. So, yeah, I don't, it was fun. I didn't really, if I really were to think about it, there's no reason for me to do the winner row at all. But I think the rewards, I think it's just going to be worth it in the end. So, I didn't make a big deal out of it, and I got through it. Still one more objective to go. And that will be in the next video, which is very soon here. But I spent out these two six-star crystals. Could have saved it for the feature, didn't really want to. Didn't really care. Maybe just awaken, like, I don't know, whoever, it right? doesn't really matter. But yeah, this objective is probably the second easiest, but based on how all of them went for me, that was actually the hardest, I would say. So, for me. But probably for everyone else, it was a bit easier than the robot objective. The robot objective actually was a little better for me. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. I'll be back soon with my robot objective video for Winter of Woe. And hopefully everyone has a great rest of their week. And I'll see you all soon.